candlelight vigil is underway right now for a popular college professor. She died on Monday this week in a fire which police do say was started by her husband. You want to give me no live for us at AM Commerce. This is where friends and colleagues of the victim are trying to tonight make sense of it all. Yona? About 100 people showed up tonight to honor her. You can still see a large group behind me as uh, the vigil winds down. And it did take place right outside the engineering building where Dr. Kim taught. Suffering Students describe Dr. Yoon Kim as one of the kindest and most loved professors they've ever had. Friends in her Rockwall neighborhood knew her as Debbie, and they were shocked to find out that the fire set by her husband, Hyun Lee, was a cover-up for a killing. That's according to police, who say he then turned the gun on himself. Officers found their young daughter safe in a car where it's believed Lee put her before setting that fire. Today, students tied ribbons and lit candles to honor her, and President Ray Keck says a scholarship fund may eventually be created in her name. And I'm sure all of you remember yours. Teachers touch our lives, touch our hearts, and change our direction forever. She did that for every one of you that was in her class. We were really fortunate to have her as a professor. And uh, there really were not a lot of dry eyes tonight as students, colleagues, and friends remembered her. As for her daughter, I'm told that she will be handed over to relatives coming over from Korea. We're live tonight in Commerce, Siona Govino, CBS 11 News.